welcome to the Miami Heat Zone Podcast. I am your host, Martel Llewellyn. Guys, if you are a Miami Heat fan, continue to like, share, comment, subscribe. Thank you for all the support. And if you're an NBA fan, subscribe to the channel. And thank you for all the support. Guys, if you're watching right now and you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button and let me know what you guys think about my channel right in the comment section. So the Heat's organization's mantra is we have enough, but do they? This is a franchise that wants to win titles and looks for ways to improve the roster. But one thing to consider, the Heat in general are not a team that makes trades during the trade deadline, especially major ones. Their last significant trade at the deadline came in 2021. My thing is, I think we do have enough to some degree. I just think this Miami Heat team, first off, has to get healthy. If we're not healthy, it's going to be very hard to beat other teams that are fully healthy, especially when you're missing some of your best players at times where we had Tyler Hero and Bam Adebayo out at the same time. Jimmy's out. Kayla Martin's out. Haywood Heisman's out. You know, Kyle Lowry, he sometimes has to sit and miss sometimes. He can't play back-to-backs. So there's a lot of things going on right now in terms of health that has to get fixed immediately. Before we start like trying to address trades anything, can this Miami Heat team be healthy? Can this roster actually play together? Can we have a full starting lineup with all of our guys actually out on the court to see what we look like as a team? Now, this is where the Miami Heat go wrong sometimes. They know that Jimmy Butler is going to miss some time. Jimmy Butler doesn't take the regular season seriously. In my opinion now, it is on Bam and Tyler Hero. They are the cornerstones going forward. They are the ready now guys. They're the young guys that are supposed to lead this team. Pat Riley challenged them to at least have 25 points a game to help Jimmy Butler out. They come first. The pressure, the responsibility, everything is on them when Jimmy Butler's out. I don't care what anyone says. And right now, Tyler Hero is not really playing that well. Don't get me wrong. I think we still need a maybe a four to go next to Bam Adebayo. I think that Kevin Love has been phenomenal. The whole Thomas Bryant thing didn't really work out the way I thought it would. I just think also, too, with Kyle Lowry, we do need some help at the point guard area. But first and foremost, Jimmy has to play some more games. Okay, we have to get healthy. And I understand that if Jimmy's not going to play, Bam and especially Tyler has to step up in Jimmy's absence. And we need to get some guys back like Caleb Martin and Haywood Heisman because they're some of our best perimeter defenders. Caleb Martin's a great cutter slasher defender. He's athletic. He gives a lot of the things that we like on this team. So overall, I'm just hoping that the Miami Heat can really turn it around during this homestand. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Like, share, comment, subscribe as we continue to push to 3,000 subscribers.